This is Natalie from 9.arrow from the Netherlands and I'm here with another video of the Altered Book series. I think it's part 9. Yeah, it's part 9. And I also think this is going to be the last video that I'm doing before the flip through. Um, as you know, I have been sick for a few days. Um, yeah, I didn't plan on that and I couldn't do a video so... Um, I'm running late because the other projects from November has already started with the design team members and I'm still working on last month project. But yeah, it is what it is. Um, I'm trying to finish it because everybody is following, well, not everybody, but those of you who are following along just want to see what happens next, which I understand. Um... The last time I um, showed you several things that I included in the journal and I think if I am correct, I'm not sure. Um, I have every page covered except this one and I also need to glue these together. Yeah, but I wanted to work on this and this is, let me check, this is going to be ephemera but I'm not really sure if I'm going to use this one as a journal card, maybe this one I will, this one I'm not sure, um, will I leave it in? But the thing I said I wanted to do something with this and I ripped out, this was originally on but I thought it was pretty dull. Uh, so I want this one to be on and well first let me do some some sort of measuring and it's not really measuring I'm just folding in I'm going to cut it and then I'm going to assemble that uh, frame onto the green paper Also need to take a little snippet of this one. I'm not sure if it's all straight. Yeah, but because um, I have been ill, I couldn't work on well any project. Um, so I'm I'm a little bit behind. That does mean I'm not able to do all the ephemera online, uh, online on camera for this journal. I simply don't have the time to do that. Um, I also have to uh, sleep and eat <laughs> and work. And obviously this week I didn't work. Well, I did work, but I went home sick. Um... So yeah, I'm 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 so far behind, but I, I'm I will try not to stress about it because well there are more important things in life than being on time. But of course I do wanna <laughs> I do wanna finish this journal and have it out of the way so I can work on new things. Um so yeah, that was uh, a little, a little bit about me being sick. I'm going to ink around this one and around this one. Also going to round the corners. And yeah, I'm going to do things off camera, inking these two. Um, and I also have like cheesecloth I want to add, but first let me do the inking and then you will see me back.
So I have everything inked and like I said, I wanted to add cheesecloth. I'm not sure I wanted to add it on this piece because that would be nice too. Or on both the pieces, maybe that's an option too. I don't know yet. Um, just figuring out. I think I will go for this one. Yeah. I want to sew around this one. But I need to... This. Something like this. I'm going to do it like this, yes. going to add a little bit of glue to keep it in place for sewing and I'm not going to put glue on the edges because then it will definitely go into my sewing machine and we want to prevent that otherwise your needle will get very 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 sticky and things go will go wrong I might even my dangle broke, I do have to fix it. It is on the desk. Uh, the little helpers uh, thought it was fun to play with the glue. I mean, these two guys, they are, they are, well, crazy together. They are sweet, but they are so, they are like little terrorists together. Really, they, they smash everything on the ground that they see, no matter if it's a glass or a plate or whatever. They keep on trying until it finally collapses on the, roof, on the floor and then, well, they go and sit in the middle of the mess and starting to meow and say, well, look at me, I've done this. They, it seems they are very proud of, of doing that. Which is weird because it's not a good thing. I have still have let this little scrap thingy and I really like this. It's the right color. But first I'm going to do the sewing on both the panels. And also have to sew onto the, the book page on the edge. And I have more pages where I need to do that. Maybe I'm going to do that at the same time. And then you will see me back and then we will start embellish. But I'm not going to... Um, well, I can sew these together maybe. Yeah, I can sew... This directly on here. That's no biggie. Uh, but first, so the edges. Yeah. You will see me back. So I've sewn around this one. And I also... I have to cut this. This is not right. And I also sewn over the frame multiple times. Like so. As you can see and I'm going to glue it onto this um, piece but I want to add a little bit more embellishment I, I said I have this piece thought about doing it like so but I'm going to add it maybe like so over here yeah and I also want to put in eyelets going to be 
like so. So you still see a little bit of the stitching over here. Uh, I want to put in eyelets. So let's do that. Two on here. And the other three going to be over here. Quickly put the eyelets in. So I put in the eyelets. One, two. Add a little saying on here. Maybe with just a little bit of cheesecloth. Not going to sew because it's very narrow. Oh, good luck. <laughs> it didn't fall on the glue side. Okay, let me see. Shall I? I think I'm going to go like so. I'm so sorry for the noise. Sorry, I forgot to put on the camera. Uh, but I just added glue only on this side, rubbing it on. And it's going to be bubbly because it's wet glue with a very thin paper. And so, yeah, of course, that is going to show. But I think it will dry up um, wrinkle free at the end. I hope. <laughs> and if not, then it's then it's okay too because I don't mind. I, I like the, the wrinkly effect, to be honest. It's going to... Just like so. Maybe now is a good time to pull up a bit from the top. Go this piece on. Where is my glue bin thing? I think I dropped it. I really have to fix it because without the beads, I keep, I keep losing the bin. It's very wet, but it's okay. Okay, let me, because this is sliding over the desk all the time. It's very wet. I know. A little bit too wide. Okay, I have to cut the 
top. It's too long, way too long. Okay, what I will do, because this really needs to dry before I move on. I am going to sew an ink, well, ink sew around these tags. I was also thinking to put them in like so, so they can move. Maybe that's fun too, with an eyelet. Usually I, I put them in like so. Have an eyelet in. And maybe I can put them in like so too. But yeah, I can't put them in right now. So I will do the inking, the sewing off camera. And then you will see me put them on. Well, you will see them in the flip through. Put on like this. With one eyelet over here. Or like so. And I think I'm going to do it like this. And then I'm also going to do some little bit bits and bobs of ephemera uh, and a little bit embellishment on the pages. Need to turn these into like um, cards, but I also have an envelope that I didn't use yet. So maybe I'm going to end up putting in this envelope. This one this also can be nice in a pocket. But yeah, I don't have time to make all the ephemera piece videos. So I think I will have to leave it with this for now. And of course you can see the things in the flip through. And uh, I also have the Lavender and Lace um, Altered Book. There I have many, many ideas too. Different than this one, to be honest. But yeah, this is it for today. Um, I hope you liked the video. I hope you want to give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you want to see the previous videos, there are eight. <laughs> uh, so if you have nothing to do, you have you can binge watch them because they are well, they are not short, but they are very um, yeah. You you can really um, find good use in a video. Although I say myself because I'm not very good at explaining normally, but I tried my best to to explain everything as good as possible. Um, the best way I can without switching and I also showed you the mistakes that I made that's that's also something um, um, well I think it's valuable because um, on video you always see the perfect creation with no flaws and no mistakes but um, yeah there are people that can do that and I, I can make a project without making mistakes too but usually I do make mistakes and I don't edit them out. I just go with it and try to solve them. So um, I hope this was helpful for you. And yeah, thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, leave a comment. And I hope to see you the next time. Greetings from the Netherlands. Bye bye. Bye.